Drain your sanity and eventually. Yeah, I know, but I don't want to look away. Wait a second. The longer you see it, you'll more likely be noticed. Yeah. Someone's looking at me. Yeah. Where is he? Yeah. I can feel your eyeballs. Paparazzi. <laughs> see, okay, this part is actually, to me personally, more freaky than the prison. Because it's just messed up. There's like hardly anywhere to. Hide. Man. It's got a lot of clunkers. See, I can see why you get disease down here. You're just like traveling in a bunch of people's fecal matter stuff. <laughs> the pipe seems to be loose. There we go. Now carrying a iron pipe. Yeah. Now I have a pipe. Why don't I use it? For defense, you know. <laughs> Daniel's like, I don't want to use it as a weapon. Why? Yeah, at the end of it's pretty pointy. I'm pretty sure you can impale someone with it. And then maybe you can throw him into that thing. <laughs> what are you doing? He pronounced it that time. Oh, What's happening? <laughs> Pronounce happening, too. <laughs> okay, so we gotta slow that thing down and then shove the, the pipe into it so it stops completely. And we hide. <laughs> Good timing. I honestly didn't even think about it. I was like, I'm just gonna hide. As long as it's here, it's convenient. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Nice, nice and deep in the matter now. <laughs> God, okay, so we're either going to A, open this door and there's a monster there, or B, we're going to open this door and a monster's going to appear from behind us. Get in, get in, get in. Writing down in his journal. Well, that didn't work. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> Sounds about correct. And back in the room. God damn. Ah, oh, yeah, I get deep in the fuck. <laughs> Mushrooms. Have you played Star Fox Adventures? I have not. Is that the one with dinosaurs? Yeah, you get like a pet, you tricky your pet dinosaur and you feed him mushrooms. It's friggin' stupid. But I actually like that game. I don't know why. Even though it's stupid, I like it. Okay. I could say something, but I'm not gonna. Why? No, I'm not gonna. No, <laughs> why? You like it for uh, Crystal, don't you? No. Uh, no. No, that's fucking weird. Eric, <laughs> I'm not a furry. I never knew. I huh? swear I'm not a furry. No, it's just actually, it's kind of cool, some of it. And I think a lot of it is just seeing the characters that you love from Star Fox Adventure. Or Star Fox 64. You ever played uh, Star Fox Assault? Yeah, I have that too. How is that? I always, Shit, I'm I sorry, always, I hate it. <laughs> I always thought it'd be a good game. Uh, are, are you back on the uh, R ring? R R wing or whatever the heck called? Yeah, uh, you're on both, like ground, the wing. So the, you're the landmaster. The, the tank, everything. All right. I like that music. Oh boy! All right. Here's the part that most people. Their penis falls off, and they never grow it back. I think I'm gonna like this part. <laughs> uh, yeah. Look at the monster. And of course, I don't mean that for the whole penis-lossing thing. I mean for the thrill. 
Oh yeah, that is a monster. This is the monster. This is what the monsters look like. Daniel, turn around this instant. You are Give it too many blowjobs. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh, there we are so stressed out. Oh. So some ninja came in here and just diced that guy. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, so... Alright! And back up here. What was that? What's with the slow scream? Oh! Oh, shit! Is he coming right for you? He was walking pretty fast, man! I don't know! Dude, I always power walk in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Look at that. What the hell? Is the Zerg? The Zerg's taking over. You're deep in the hive now. Yeah. I am the overmind. The eternal will of the swarm. Awaken, my child. And embrace the glory that was your birthright! Fear not death. Did I just... You imagine the whole thing. Can we get on with our lives? <laughs> <laughs> Did I just see a body? Alright, I think... If I remember correctly... Let's give him a hand! Okay, I've used that joke already. But you know what? It's still funny. <laughs> Look at this. Woo! Windmills. I will... I have an arm and I'm not afraid of Just dip it into the water. Okay, so I'm going to be very, very cautious. Doesn't this, okay, first of all, this hand, what's with the, f the fingers? I want to wonder why it's so much, like, jello. Look at it. It's so wavy. This guy had no muscle. So, okay, this is crazy. This whole room is a, is a circle. Like, it goes around, not in a circle, but it goes around. And, um... Yep. So pretty much, and he's guarding the door to make sure that we don't go in there. Uh -huh. But we've got to somehow get him distracted so then we can run around the corner. Is he moving right now? Or no, he, he doesn't move, he just stands at the door. <laughs> oh my god uh, holy shit what the fuck go 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 climb climb <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure he doesn't, like, come after you once you're up here. See, he's crying right now because he's like, I could have stopped you. Come back. Yeah. I'll just scream up the tunnel. Maybe he'll come back now. Oh, you wanted me? Okay. I'll come back now. <laughs> Show that pit who's boss. <laughs> there is never any escape. Things like this live with you always. How could you know if Henry would show up down the road or even at his house? Well, I can't say I quite understand. No, I don't. All right, so we got another tinder cylinder, and we're coming in here. Dude, that part just got me pumped. All right, I love the thrill of the adventure. I want to see mountains, Gandalf. Mountains. <laughs> All right. Okay, so here's where we're going to. Uh, Meet someone very special. Holy shit. It's power run down those stairs. Blind again. God. Ripper, I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon. I won't even be able to move. Will I? Your life is safe. Ugh. I don't doubt that. But will be worth living. 
Spade. I actually really like that quote. <laughs> I don't doubt that. No. <laughs> yeah, where he's like, your life will be safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? Mm. But yeah, anyway. Okay, here's Agrippa. Okay. <laughs> I guess it won't be worth living, will it? Thank you. You have my gratitude. My name is Agrippa. What you think? Dying? Like some frog thrown into the lion's den? Tell me, are you among the lion's den? Well, sort of. What happens if you touch him? Uh, you can't touch him because he's. Oh, spikes. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like you need a press there. Uh, <laughs> he's writing down in his diary, I am going batshit crazy right now. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay. No. Good God, no. So anyway, you can actually help Acrobat. This is like, there are a couple different endings to the game, and if you help him, you get the one where, like, he comes with you, but you, so... How does he actually walk? Looks like his legs are no longer functioning. No, you'll see. It's pretty messed up. There we go. Alright, we're coming here. A bunch of meat. What is this? This is the uh, torture room. These are like the. They look like insane asylums. Alright, let's see. Rattle your chains! Those are the rooms where they hose you down, decontaminate, <laughs> oh, fire hose. It's horrible. Ugh. Oh. Decay smoke, don't breathe this. Alright, uh, actually, really creepy story, um, and actually, I don't even know if I should say this, but I just read um, an article of this guy, who, uh, this elderly woman that he was working for, the elderly woman had caught, had caught him stealing from her. Uh -huh. And so she fired him. You know what he did? He came back with a, a like a propane tank filled with. The, he like made his own ghetto version of a flamethrower and burned her alive. Whoa! <laughs> what did they even do? I don't even know. I know they arrested him, but yeah, man. He ended up being burnt himself. Like he burnt her, and then he like set himself on fire on accident. Well, he did say it was Jerry rigged, so it was probably all faulty and it was falling right. apart. But I'm just thinking, like, what the hell? <laughs> like, what an asshole. Not, e not even just an asshole. I mean, I can't just be like, oh, what an asshole. But <laughs> that's just messed up, dude. You can build a flamethrower and set you on fire. Right. Might as well as just doused her in, like, petrol and light her up. Actually, I think he did that, too. He, like, he kept throwing, like, gasoline on her. And then she was, like, cor in an elevator in the corner, and he just kind of lit the whole thing on fire. And then started, like, burning it through the thing. I'm like, what the hell? People like that deserve a worse punishment than jail. 20 to life. Right. You are now sentenced to, sentenced to four consecutive years, in pr or four consecutive life sentences in prison. Bitch, I ain't gonna fucking live that long. <laughs> Ooh. My personal favorite is uh, this one woman went to prison for like six months for killing somebody, well, as opposed to this other woman who went to prison for ten years for having some marijuana on her, and she had children and stuff. <laughs> it's like marijuana is more illegal than murder. It's <laughs> Oh, our judging system is out of whack. It's just a myth after all. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so something's going on. Uh, I gotta find out where to go in the next place, you know. Chicken.
continue the adventure, please comment, like, and subscribe. If you did, it would make me really happy. Um, bye.